you guys i cannot come up here and fake laugh to you guys I get deported which is one thing that i didn't want to you know get myself involved in i didn't want to you know i was going through a lot dubai was stressing me i was i was facing so much you know dubai was just giving me a dick dubai was giving me hypertension dubai was at that point it was leading me to depression I'm hey blessed ones hello blessed queens how are you guys doing you welcome back to my channel oh my goodness you guys if you're seeing my face for the very first time you're highly welcome my name is blessing i'm a nigeria youtuber based in nigeria currently <laughs> please do where to click on the icon that says subscribe so you'll be part of the beautiful and amazing families and for my returning subscribers thank you guys so so much i really do appreciate you guys like you guys you all mean a lot to me so without further ado i don't want this intro to be too long let's just dive right into the video <laughs> so you guys in, th in today's video this is an updated video i just want to update you guys what's going on or what has been going on in my life why I, I stayed so long on youtube like you guys youtube is not somewhere or a place you come and go where you don't actually have that fan base already but i'm going to be telling you guys why i went away for a long period of time okay yeah so if it's what you would love to listen to please just keep on watching uh as you already know i'm in nigeria i'm back to nigeria with my background you know that i'm in nigeria maybe my, not the background right but i'm in nigeria back to nigeria i'll be back since two months now no not up to two months over a month right now and it's been exciting it's been awesome it's been wonderful and i'm grateful to god so you guys that aside let me just you guys why i've been away for it this long period of time first of all it was like you guys my break was never intentional i didn't plan it i didn't even thought of it but you know life happens yeah um along the line i lost all my videos if you if you guys pay attention back to my channel you know that i was doing uh reaction videos right i was doing reaction videos you know to get my four thousand watch hours and you know i already had my one thousand subscribers right so which i actually got and while i got that as at the time i got the four thousand watch hours i realized that youtube was doing something that you short videos that actually make you know combine that make that four thousand watch hours completed because my face was wasn't in it my my voice wasn't in it so those videos were not monetized i wasn't able to monetize those videos so i had to delete those videos or hide those videos right and that aside i lost all my videos you guys if you know one thing about this content creation thing if you sit down and do a, a sit down video just as a, a story time kind of videos if i lost that video if i'm trying to do it again it's not going to be as authentic as that first video it's just like me forcing myself trying to you know make it up again and i lost a lot of videos like my reaction videos more than 20 reaction videos that i filmed i lost everything my vlogs i lost everything and that just killed the morale you guys that killed the morale of filming you know trying to go film the videos that i've already filmed the reaction videos that i've already done trying to go back there to do them it wasn't an easy task okay that's the truth then my dubai issue came up if you've been following my channel you know that i've explained this thing several times i've told you guys that i had issues with the dubai government i i was arrested go back to my videos to watch it i was arrested reasons i was arrested i think I've, I've i've you know said it i have a video of that also so i was arrested and i spent over two weeks close to three weeks in the prison and i got released and i started doing court case with them and after the court case unknowing to me that the case wasn't over but the uh, owner like my boss the owner of the company didn't tell me that the case was not over she only told me i didn't need to come that the case was over so i was ready to go back to nigeria if you're if you're familiar with nigeria you you know that for a long period of time visa has not been going for nigerians if you you know have visas before they don't renew because of my nationality right so all of that was you know was just i would like put it like everything was just happening at a time at one particular time i don't know if that english makes any sense so um me now i wanted to get, you know get my ticket and come back home just to relax my brain 
getting my ticket i don't just know what happened my friend just told me you know what you need to go to the immigration like my the the, the immigration itself allow immigration i need to go there to go verify to check my status if everything is okay you guys lo and behold i went there got in there i you know told them my situation i showed them the message they sent me i will look for it if i still have it i'll post it here is is everything is written in arabic anyways so i put i showed them the letter and the first lady i met was really pissed she was like why on earth am i coming now why did i come the day the, the the last day of the court i was like no the my boss asked me not to come that it was just you know a paperwork they were going to do and she was like no i still have case she only closed her own case which they find her for me she still want me to continue the case because i didn't pay with i didn't pay the amount she paid and i'm like okay what do i need to do they said i was supposed to get a lawyer immediately that case was closed which is they have a grace of 15 days after that 15 days there's nothing you know nothing can be done i'm like why i have no idea you know and then they now said i have to pay some amount of money i have to pay ten thousand dirhams let me just be saying it here i have to pay ten thousand dirhams and um you know go back to my country but if i refuse to pay i will have to serve jail for that amount so a day is 100 dirhams like uh, 90 days which is three months is nine thousand dirhams so um, let me just say i'm spending four months in the prison and i'm like i can't do that that is not no god did not no god cannot allow that impossible can't that's impossible and you know we did our back and forth back and forth back and forth and glory be to god i had to pay the ten thousand dirhams and you know as at the time these things were going on dollar inflation was just everywhere dollar was rising the money you know calling naira to 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 dubai is not a beast you, you know what it means when you're calling your naira back to the country currency where you are it's always not cheap you know when you're, calling, when you're sending your money like you're sending your your country currency to nigeria is quite you know cheap but when you're calling the money back it's very very expensive and that killed you know at which i did and i'm so grateful to the people god blessed me with you know i paid that money and i have to now you know uh, apply for fine reduction because i was already on overstay so that would be another video entirely how i cleared my overstay so i can go back to dubai whenever i feel like going back to dubai right so that as i told that was the main reason as i mean lost you know losing all of those my videos the issue i had with dubai was one like it is the major reason why i stayed up because you guys i cannot come up here and fake laugh to you guys start smiling fake smile I'm one person that I'm a very happy soul. I'm a very, very jolly good fellow. How do they say that? Say, a jolly good fellow. That's what I am or who I am. I laugh a lot. I, I laugh a lot. I smile a, a lot. I, I hardly get angry. I hardly excuse my face. You always see me smiling. No matter what you tell me, I always laugh, you know. So I didn't want to come up here and start faking smile for you people when deep down I know that I'm not happy. With my face, you will know that this girl is passing through a lot and you people did not send me a message. So coming up here to start faking smile and the the body is written all over me. I didn't find it, you know, encouraging. That was one of the main reasons I didn't, you know, bother to you know do videos and post which i have vlogs so i just wanted to you know update you guys i'm back to nigeria before i can you know now start posting my old vlogs i will just try and edit and combine everything together for you guys to watch so you guys that is the main reason why i've been away a lot was just going on life was life with me you know everything was just happening and i'm grateful to god you know because at the end of the day it is god that you know make everything possible because I, maybe i met you know also i might have you know gone back to the prison and serve that uh, uh, that month they asked me to serve and you know get deported which is one thing that i didn't want to you know get myself involved in i didn't want to you know be deported i because you know dubai is not a country where you want to be deported now dubai is a country where you want to you know live life and i have friends i have plans of you know touring dubai with my friends going out having a guest 
you know trip together and i didn't want to get deported that was why i had to pay that amount of money it's not that, like i have so much money and i'm also grateful to to the people around me my girlfriends my male friends like everybody just made everything possible for me you know it was even my friend that just suggested like somebody so special suggested that ah, i you know i explained to the person it was like no you can't do that the first payment i made he sent me that money i went to you know verify like god has been faithful god has blessed me with so many persons you know and also god has blessed me with this youtube community that i have so many amazing beautiful souls around me even my facebook like i didn't even know that i post my videos like my link on my facebook right but i didn't know that facebook people normally watch my videos because you know facebook eh, is an is in a, like facebook is just another word entirely but me seeing facebook people coming to my dm every time oh you've 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 thrown you've thrown us away you are depriving us from seeing your faces and all of that i'm like okay you people actually watch my videos i'm so grateful your comments your videos like your dms all the time it means a lot to me i know i'm not social like i'm not really active on instagram which i really want to start doing right now but at the end of the day i just want to say thank you to you guys you guys mean so so much to me i can't thank you guys enough you, you right you guys are uh uh, the reason why I am still back here now to do this video because if nobody watches me, I won't be here. I'm grateful to you guys. I love you guys so so much. Like I cannot even thank you guys enough. Enough, you, you guys. I can't thank you guys enough. But yeah, this is the main reason I went. I was going through a lot. Dubai was stressing me. I was I was facing so much. You know, Dubai was just giving me a dick. Dubai was giving me hypertension. Dubai was only, you know, Dubai was. At that point, it was leading me to depression. I'm not even gonna lie, but at the end of the day, we overcome it, and here I am. I'm in Nigeria, enjoying my life, <laughs> flexing my life. Yeah. So you guys, if you want to know, or you are uh, like, if you live in Dubai currently and you're in overstay and you want to go back to Nigeria, you don't want to get deported with the normal art pass stuff, and you want to know how to go through the um the pay the fine reduction how to apply for fine reduction and everything how i did my just let me know at the comment section and i'll sure do that for you so next time you can go back to nigeria apply for you can go back to dubai apply for dubai visa and you get your dubai visa and always go back there to have fun yeah so you guys thank you guys so so much that is why i've been away <laughs> thank you guys i love you guys so much please help me to watch this video share so everybody will know that i am back i love you guys Bye.